Two symptoms of high cholesterol that can appear on the face. See your GP if they appear. High cholesterol is a prerequisite for serious health conditions, such as heart attacks and strokes. Thus, if you notice any of the following warning signs, do seek medical attention as soon as possible. According to the American Academy of Dermatology Association, AAD, yellowish-orange growths might appear on the eyelids if you have high cholesterol. Medically referred to as xanthelasma, these are painless, visible lumps on the eyelids that indicate there is a high amount of cholesterol deposits under the skin. Another sign of high cholesterol to watch out for on the face is Arcus Senilis. The Mayo Clinic explains, Arcus Senilis is a gray, or white, arc visible above and below the outer part of the cornea, the clear, dome-like covering over the front of the eye. Eventually, the arc may become a complete ring around the colored portion, iris, of your eye. Fat deposits deep in the edge of the cornea leads to arcus senilis, but it is a fairly common feature of older age. Anybody presenting signs of xanthelasma or arcus senilis might have an inherited cholesterol condition. The British Heart Foundation, BHF, touched on familial hypercholesterolemia, which affects around 250,000 Britons. BHF Chair of Cardiovascular Genetics at University College London, Professor Steve Humphreys spoke on the subject matter. Familial hypercholesterolemia is a genetic condition that causes high cholesterol from birth. Studies have shown that the risk of developing coronary heart disease is up to 13 times higher in people with untreated familial hypercholesterolemia, FH, said Professor Humphreys. There are three, classic signs, of FH, two of which have been touched upon. Yellow cholesterol buildup around the eyelids. Pale ring around the iris of the eye. Cholesterol deposits around the knuckles or Achilles tendon. If a close male relative has had a heart attack before the age of 55, or before 65 in a female relative, then you can ask your doctor to test your cholesterol levels. The BHF says, it is important to identify FH as early in life as possible, so that you can get treatment and support.